Hello everybody, I'm Beta and welcome back to another episode of Dark Souls You Say I Play. Uh, the series where we are currently playing through Dark Souls 2 um, in the fashion that is kind of unique. Uh, basically, if you guys feel like sending me to a certain boss uh, in the comments section anytime you want, I will certainly, you know, do that and go through with it, try and kill that boss um, in the order that you want with the gear that you want me to use, um, you know. This is where I kind of draw a line a little bit though. I'm kind of like be kind because Fighting the Capra Demon with the broken sword over and over again dealing two damage per hit is not really fun uh, To be honest, so I, I kind of didn't anticipate that um, When I was setting up the series it's but it's been a bit of an experiment It has been fun anyway, and nevertheless, and we will be continuing it anyway um, So we will be cracking on uh, So if you do want me to use a specific kind of weapon or do a boss in a certain order or, order or kill a boss in a certain way uh, anything like that role play with certain armor if you if you want anything that you like feel free to suggest in the comments Even if you're a new viewer can be anybody Just give me a heads up and these episodes are only recorded one at a time as well, so um, Don't worry about that. Don't worry about being late if you're looking at the the latest episode Likely the chances are that you know and I've not done the one after that yet, so uh, feel free to throw it out there and right now, we are working our way down. It has been a touch, uh, a little while since um, we jumped on this series. I think it's been a couple of weeks. I mean, I guess that's not too long, but you get the idea. Uh, we've brought the Halberd out to kill the Black Knight, though I can't exactly remember, if I'm being totally honest, why I'm coming down to this area. But we will continue to do it nonetheless. Um, I'm actually recording this episode directly after... Um, I can't remember which Dark Souls 3 episode it is, but I did a three of them, you know, in a string. So if you're aware of that and you watch the episode, you know which one I'm talking about, then you know when this is being recorded. <laughs> um, right after that uh, Dark Souls 3 episode uh, of, like, the chunk of three, when I recorded all of, them, all of them at the same time, you know what I mean? This is the fourth episode of a video that I'm recording to today. Oh god, rip! But yeah, that's that anyway. You get the idea. Now let's uh, let's get some drinking done and actually take care of this guy before you know <laughs> I, I lose my rag being stupid. There you go. It's really not difficult to take advantage there. <laughs> I was just basically lost in my commentary for a moment. But we are back. We will tighten this guy up without too much issue, I believe. So don't you guys worry. We will not be dying here today. I mean, we might die in the episode, but I'm just saying we're not going to die to this Black Knight, that's for sure. There we go. Man, jumping from Dark Souls 3 right into Dark Souls 1. Seems interesting. <laughs> I have actually been considering doing a, a little bit um, more of a variety kind of thing recently, where, you know, I don't just do soul stuff, I do play a couple of other things as well, because, you know, I have done that on the channel before. Um, uh, I have played a bit of Oblitus. In fact, we completed Oblitus from start to finish on the channel, in addition to uh, a couple of episodes of uh, Soma, Isaac, and the Order 1886. I, I think a couple of these I, I took down. I took down because I, ne I never ended up completing them, and um, from a technical point of view, they weren't great anyway, so I, I did scrap them. But we have actually done a, a bit of variety stuff on this channel before, and I would like to do that again at some point. Right now might be difficult because we have got a playthrough of both Dark Souls 1 and Dark Souls 3 going at the same time, so I can only manage so much. Um, so it may not be right away, but at some point I definitely do want to mix things up a little bit. Uh, maybe I could introduce um, a different game and then put one of these Souls series on the back burner for a little bit. And it'll probably end up being this one, if any. Um, but nothing's set in stone uh, just yet. I will need to, you know... Wait and see how things go from that point of view. But right now, I bet you are wondering where we're going. And rightly so, because for one, I don't know where I'm going. I don't know why. I can't remember why I was coming down in this direction. Um, but it is going to give me an opportunity to do something that one of you guys suggested. Any uh, you guys will see. You guys will see what that is. Don't you worry. Don't you worry. We're not going to be taking on these drakes, though, that's for sure. There we go. 
get into this little hole, hidey hole there in the wall where you can get the humanity. And we will trot onto our destination. I guess I can't really commentate about that because I want it to be a little bit of a surprise. Surprise that uh, a couple of you guys wanted me to, to do, which we will do. That's where I'm going right now. And I've got the feeling it's not going to be exactly where you guys expect. We'll grab that. And we'll... Ah, screw it, we'll do it. There you go. Okay. <laughs> One shot. You died. Yes, that is correct. We'll continue using this route as the, the direction where we will be going, though. For sure's is. Pop this again. I could have sent the lift back up, but I didn't think that we were going to die there, to be honest. Can actually show a little bit of a technique as well on this guy, on that big dragon that killed us. Um, if a few of you guys didn't know, maybe some of you guys will be surprised, maybe not. I mean, it's nothing groundbreaking or anything, but it's a little detail that I feel like some may overlook. Uh, as well as that, I have also been thinking um, a fair bit recently about my top games, my top 25 games of all time, and I've actually made a list, and I went through it on stream recently. Uh, if you're interested in catching me live, by the way, this is a nice segue. <laughs> Twitch.tv forward slash betawolflp. The link will be down below anyway. Uh, feel free to take a look at that if you like. Um, and, yeah, the, the point being, I did go through it on Twitch, my top 25 games of all time. Uh, some interesting picks on there, I think. It's, it's good to actually reminisce about quite a few of them. And, you know, it, it did spark a bit of discussion uh, with those that were watching. You know, the viewers that I had... Uh, while I was live there, uh, which is fun. We were both debating, you know, my picks, and I was explaining my picks on why I think this game over that game, and and so on. In addition to getting an idea for, um, you know, their games as well, which games they really like, and I can kind of bring that into. Come on, Dark Souls. I, spoiler: I put you at the top of this top 25 games of all time list as well. So don't be doing me dirty with some bullshit, <laughs> okay? <laughs> But, um, yeah, uh, continuing this discussion, uh, you can go up here. This is the tip that I was originally looking at. I feel like some people may overlook this. I don't often see people come up here. Uh, you can attack him from here, and he can't touch you at all. Um, you know, you can throw various things down on him, and it's a good little skip. A skip by him if you want to uh, be at a safe distance. You can just climb up here. Um, but in addition to that, uh, moving the discussion forward, which is what I was aiming for. Aiming for. Um, games. Best games of all time. Uh, feel free to let me know, guys, what you guys think about that. Uh, that's pretty much where I was going with this discussion. I'm kind of curious as to, uh, you know, what you guys think as viewers for your favourites. All-time favourites. They can be on any console or PC, whatever. And um, I bet you guys are thinking that I'm going to go down there now, right? I bet you guys thought that's what I was thinking of. No, it is not. That is not what got suggested. Got suggested, Or at least it didn't get suggested as much as what we're about to do. Um, use that master key there, very nice. I brought it along nice and handy for us, uh, just in case people suggested certain things that could have, you know, scuppered us if we didn't have the master key. Uh, but nevertheless, um, yeah, let me, let me know, guys. As I work towards this objective here, that we'll be going for. Let me know what uh, all-time favourite games you guys have got. Because I am genuinely curious. You don't need to list your all-time 25 or anything. Maybe I'll do that in a video at some point. Um, maybe I shall... Uh, maybe just discuss it in a video. We'll see. What would you guys like? Would you guys like me to discuss that? My top 25 games of all time. I mean, it could be a long one, so maybe if I don't know what would work better there. Maybe a dedicated video towards it or just discuss it on a in an episode of, you know, Dark Souls or something. That would allow for some okay discussion. Did we never grab the fat ring? Or did we let well we certainly didn't let him kill her because she's still there. Did I kill him and then not pick up the ring. That would not be intelligent. Um, but yeah, either way, 
uh, moving forth, we will rest at this bonfire because it will be useful for us. And um, you guys may know what I'm thinking by now. You guys may know, may know. Especially when you see this item and the direction that we start running. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm not sure whether a dedicated video or just talking about it in an episode, in a regular episode of Dark Souls would be better. Because I could keep the list open on another screen and kind of convey my thoughts about that, but it might end up being a little bit broken up because there could be a lot to talk about and I could get distracted by the game every now and then. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Yeah, we'll see about that. It's an idea, at least. Um, but in a way, it, it, either way, moving forward, uh, you guys have guessed it. Uh, moving along from that discussion about the games, um, you guys have guessed it. We are going to pinwheel on this episode. A few of you guys suggested it, and uh, you know the comments that you guys left on that kind of got thumbed up by other people. So, pinwheel shall be our next boss in the game. <laughs> Despite having only killed uh, the Asylum Demon, the Taurus Demon, and did we even kill Capra? I can't remember if we went and killed him or not. I know we, we gave a few attempts on him, but I can't remember if we won. So, yeah, I'm not sure. I think so far, Asylum Demon, Taurus Demon, and that's it. Maybe Capra? <laughs> and then we're on to pinwheel already. That is the order that we've done these bosses in. Kind of crazy. I mean, I'm sure you know it's possible, but um, it is interesting actually doing it. It's been a very long time since I've given something like this a go. And you know what? Let's actually just... Oh, God. At least get a shield. I'm dead. Maybe that'll save me. Oh, jeez. The one-handed. That's why I didn't have a shield. I remember now. Oh, we're dead. We are so dead. Yeah. <laughs> I'm trying to stay true to your suggestions here, guys. You're going to have to deal with the deaths. Honestly, I... I don't know if it's fun to watch or not. Um, the deaths and struggling with low damage. Uh, I don't know if that is good for you guys. I'm not sure how that's perceived, but... Um, I I'm glad that I've given this style of playthrough a go at least, despite only being a few episodes deep, I have got the feel for it, and yeah, I'm, I'm glad I've given it a go, I'm glad I've experimented with it, um, being intrigued by the suggestions that you guys have picked up, and tried to give my wholehearted, honest approach to it in the way that you guys have suggested, so it has been quite fun for me as well to a certain degree uh, so far, though i got to say it's not worked exactly as, I as I've... Um, uh, exactly how as I've pictured it to be. Uh, I didn't I didn't think it would just be like a sadistic, low damage, um, two hits per swing um, kind of run or anything like that. I, I thought you guys may have taken a different option on it, but I, I'm glad I've given it a go nonetheless. But right now we do need to start up this bonfire. We can at least rest here now, hopefully. Well, we've lit it. We've lit it. Um, and considering nothing was actually suggested in terms of leveling up my stuff here as well, I should have probably just <laughs> upgraded my gear before I came down here, before struggling with it, but we will crack on. We'll crack on and try and do it. Holy hell, it does take a good while though. At least we've killed the Necromancer, so these guys aren't respawning, but we do need to... Um, certainly. What do you call it? <laughs> Rest at this bonfire and unlock this door at some point. Holy crap. I'm clicking square, guys. Like, the delay should not be that much. That was on point, that was good. God, it takes forever to kill these guys. This is what I mean. It's kind of tedious, right? I mean, it'd still probably be fun if it was my first ever playthrough of Dark Souls, but knowing everything about it and what you can do in the game, uh, when you set yourself back to that, and like I said, I've done the challenge runs before, but 
I guess this isn't why I've done many of the low damage ones, because they just end up tedious and kind of boring. Personally, people can feel different, but um, that's it at least. And I don't want to sound all negative, because I am still having some fun, of course. I'm on Dark Souls, how can I not be having fun? But uh, that's what I meant when I said like the style of gameplay didn't exactly tie into how I thought it would go. Um, you know, when I was talking about what you guys would pick and things like that. But, um, yeah, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. We'll see how it all goes from here. We can still do some good stuff, that's for sure. There we go. Wrap up around this way. Like that. And, oh yeah, we need to do this first, don't we? We need to grab this bridge. Avoid all the exploding skulls. In addition to the enemies. Because you are out of your damn mind if you think I'm clearing every single enemy in this area right now as we go through in this current situation. I don't even have a I don't even have a shield to hold up, guys. I've just got to rely on the on the dodges, <laughs> the dodge rolls, and baiting the enemies to certain areas. Okay. There we go. Good, 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 good. That's what I want. And we are actually looking for something here as well. I think I'm going the right way for it. I think... There it is. There it is. I've had a change of heart. In switching over to... Um, well, we've not got enough decks, so that's effed. Um, in, in switching over to the Halberd in Dark Souls 3, uh, instead of uh, deciding on the Halberd for our Dark Souls 1 playthrough that we've got going on right now, I think we'll be doing the Great Scythe. It's been absolutely ages since I've uh, given it a go and now we've actually got the um, you know ability to use it we can use it on this playthrough unless of course like I say you guys suggest anything else or you want to see anything more fancy or uh, something a bit more challenging or something more powerful you know like I say feel free but I think the the Great Scythe could be a good one for us to go through on this playthrough all things considered Okay. Anywho, let's let's go. Let's push that lever open. Good. And uh, now we'll get by these skeletons. We just need to jump down to Vamos. This is not the ideal way to get to Pinwheel, by the way. I I, I do know maybe you, some of you guys will be suggesting the easier way, but I'm just I'm just doing it for the sake of getting down here right now. There he is. Kaboom. Be gone with you. You'll spoil my focus. You'll spoil my focus. <laughs> Big Vamos. The legendary... Oh, I'm glad you dropped down. Oh, I do appreciate that. Uh, the big legendary skeleton miner. Sadly never got completed to the degree that FromSoft wanted. Um... Still, though, still uh, cool to go down and see him every now and then. What's that then? Need some smithing? Then produce me some wares. Let's purchase some items. Might as well stock up on them, because they'll be needed. If that'll be all, then be gone with you. You'll spoil my focus. Okay, Vamos, don't worry. We know that will spoil your focus, but we only need some Titanite, so we are on our way again right now. Don't you worry. There we go. God, remember f these guys for the first time? Holy hell. <laughs> oh, I definitely need to use the, the, the claw on the controller to be, you know, totally wary and understanding where these guys are. Sure. Be careful of those guys coming. Be careful. Now we'll put the black leather boots on. Keep with our our stuff here too. I feel like that looks good. That looks totally okay. Kind of tough, leathery. Um, you know, gauntlets uh, to protect our, you know, arms and legs while having chainmail, chest, and headpiece. 
interesting setup. But here we go. Here, here it is, guys. You got it. You got what you wanted. Oh, <laughs> there he is. There he is. <laughs> I love that. I love the way that they just they, they kind of retch at you. They do retch. Oh damn, looking at this, maybe Pinwheel will end up being a challenging fight. Especially because my stamina's really boxed as well. Clear out a couple of the mimics because we. Yeah, he's gonna actually deal okay damage to us as well, that's the scary thing. Um. We're clearing out the mimics because we don't want them to, you know, hit us while we're facing the real one. Oh god. Oh Jesus, really? Oh my god. I don't know how I'm unable to hit some of these things. Being careful with our stamina management now as well. Got hit in the back. Are you the real one? Are you the real pin? Um, what? Okay, maybe we did get him anyway and he just still wanted to perform his animation. What happened there? There we go, we got that one. Yeah, we just need to wail on the real guy as well at some point. I think I'm going to die here, guys, I'll be honest. <laughs> it's rare that you get to long, though, at least. Oh, God. I can't believe I'm gonna die to pinwheel. Yeah, there it is. Well, it's rare that you get to hear that soundtrack. <laughs> oh, there it is. I think it was a bad idea to record four episodes in a row. <laughs> Not of this, but I did three of Dark Souls, three eggs, like, directly before this. Uh, and now I'm on this. But, um... Anyway. Let's, uh... Let's do some stuff here. Let's make some stuff happen. We'll go back down to him. After squeezing a couple of souls. Let's see. There we go. I mean, we might have enough there at 3,000. I can't remember what it is to level up. It is enough. So we can get our dex to 13 there. I think that'll make it okay. <clears throat> And then let's get some try, try hard in action going. Oh, it's 14 for that. Okay. Maybe we can do a bit of this. Then, like I say, get some try hard action going. We'll try and, you know, we'll tidy this guy up in a respectable fashion. Nothing else, though. Nothing else. No more souls there. That's rough. We'll farm a couple of these guys. We'll farm a couple of these dudes, and then... Uh, you know, see what awaits. I can't believe the level of damage, though. Oh, God. <laughs> I mean, it's certainly a new take uh, on the game for people that have maybe never seen it without really leveling much up, you know, keeping things, uh, like, pretty base, uh, at least at this stage in the game. Yeah, people, like, new new players to the game, it might sound all well and good once you actually know how the game's going and stuff, but once you actually, if you think back to the days when you were a new player in one of these games, a lot of people actually experienced it this way, For those, so for those that have forgotten those times, welcome to this episode. <laughs> I'm sure you guys can sympathise and understand with uh, the situation here. Um, but anyway, that's that. Okay. 
Alrighty, let's try and... Damn, we've really not got any more souls there, and these guys don't give us shit. How much is it to level up? Oh, God. Level up. An extra thousand. Oh, that's going to take forever. You know what? Let's just go back down to the fight with him. Let's go back down to the fight. Uh, and let's actually take a look. I will use that. I will use some lightning on him. Hopefully that'll make things a little simpler. We can also do, you know, show the quicker run down here now as well. I'm sure people are, uh, are aware, but... The other way, because we, we got the great scythe from there, but... If we want to go quicker, we can just do it this way. Like so, and like that. And, um, well, well, we'll chug. We'll chug to make sure. But then you go right down to this bit. And you are golden. Kaboom. BS. Nice. We could kill the skeletons that way a little easier, I guess, if we're looking at farming them. Farming them at all. But uh, you get the idea. You get the point. They still don't damage from our regular swings, do they? Sip up. Just be careful. And get going. Get running. Oh, I hear him. I hear him coming. Oh, we're safe. We made it. Damn, I am sweltering, I'll be honest. It's hot as hell today. I don't cope well with the, the big heat, you know? I do not cope well with all that. I forgot to take that one, I guess, but that's okay. Skip the cutscene. And this time, maybe try and focus on the actual pinwheel himself a little bit more. There we go. Much better with a fire buff. Still got to be careful of some of the mimics. Want to still thin out the herd a little bit with them, and be wary of the damage that they can still deal to us. Okay, okay, avoid that. I mean, it might sound crazy acting that way, all frantic, uh, with Pinwheel, but you got to understand, uh, we're, <laughs> we're fighting him as like our third boss in the game right now. Um... Or fourth. The fourth at the last, right? The latest, the very minimum. Um, so, like, the, our HP right now isn't isn't massive, and the armor that we've got isn't great, and it's not upgraded. Same for our weapons. Throw all those into into context together, and you've got a, a boss fight rather challenging. So you do need to, to be aware of that for sure. Whoa, how many is there here? This is the thing, I don't think I've ever let him, you know, point before. Or at least if I have, it was years ago, on like a... Just solely on um, not upgrading any gear, or and beating everything from baseball and stuff like that. Okay, we are thinning them out. Find the real one at some point. Like that stamina res, thin out a couple of these. We still hit you. I know I said as well we were letting you guys hear the soundtrack earlier, but let's be real, it's not a great soundtrack anyway, this one. <laughs> it's not an awesome one. God, we've gone through all of them, and it's the last guy. It's literally the last guy! Oh, it's gonna be that thing. I don't know why some of those hits aren't registering. It is actually that guy. This is the one. Oh god. He's one with the dodges, like I guess that's why some of them weren't hitting. Maybe we were, we were slightly out of range. Like I said, that's the thing. You've got to uh, understand and remember how each game works. Having played Demon Souls, Dark Souls 3 and Dark Souls 1 all in... You know, close proximity to, to each other. Uh, for sure, so you've got to take that into account and understand it. The game's different. Mask of the Child, okay, sweet. And there we go, guys. That's it, that's Pinwheel. That's Pinwheel paid off. We got him, guys. That's a boss down. We beat him in the game when you guys suggested it. We have fulfilled one of your, you know, bargaining cards. <laughs> if you can say it that way. Really interesting. Went on a lot longer than um, I kind of expected, to be honest. We will Homeward Bone back and get the hell out of here. Uh, 
And that's that done. I hope you guys are happy that I was managed that I managed to fulfill, you know, fulfill this strategy. <laughs> this uh, approach so far. That's actually a really fun fight. Like I said, it's rare that you get to see him spawn so many clones things like that because he's such a pushover at the at the time when you normally come and fight him. But uh, that was actually a really fun fight. I quite enjoyed that. Made things a bit more interesting for sure. But uh, as I was saying as well, the games are all different. They've all got their own kind of balance and me mechanic and way of working. So that's it, the feel of it. Just like the parries, the feel of it is different um, when you're back from game to game. So, you know, it's, you know, interesting to get the feel for this one again and uh, how to hit and, you know, play in the combat, things like that. I mean, it's all generally the same premise, but things are, they do feel different, I gotta say. And this still reigns as the, the king for me, that's for sure, but uh, the others are still extremely fun as well. And it shows if you don't pay attention, that can still happen. <laughs> Man, Ripperino right there. But I think we can end this on a good note right now, guys. I think uh, now will be a good time to end out the episode. Half an hour in, just kill the boss. And, yeah, that will wrap this one up. I think this is episode 5, from what I remember. Uh, episode 5 of our interesting playthrough that we've got going here. Dark Souls, you say, I play. And once again, feel, comment, feel free to, you know, bring that forward in the comments again. Where would you like to see me go next? Who would you like to see me fight? Uh, is there a particular way that you'd like me to see, you know, that you'd like to see me kill, kill a boss in? Or anything like that. You understand the idea, right, guys? So, um, yeah, that's Pinwheel done and dusted. We're only level 20 right now. We came to him pretty damn early for our third or fourth boss in the game. And that shall wrap up the episode. Hope you all enjoyed, guys. I know I certainly did. Thank you all very much for watching, as per usual. And I'll see you guys next time. Umbasa.